大家好，今天我们来学第二十四课《看杂技》。这一课只有三个语法点，我们来看一下。我忘不了的是那种对小孩子的不人道的训练。忘不了 means cannot forget. To better understand this structure, let's first look at the positive form of potential complement. This structure is used to express the possibility of an expected result being achieved. Therefore, this complement should be an expected result of this verb. For example, 吃得完吃 is a verb means to eat. 完 Is a complement means finish. So, 吃得完 means eat something and finish it. The negative form of this structure is to replace the with 不 For example, 吃不完吃不完 Means eat, but cannot finish it. However, sometimes some verbs do not really have a result, such as 动 to move. The result of moving is moving. And under some other circumstances, some verbs has a pr pretty clear result. It's very evident, like 忘 forget. For this, for these verbs, we can use 了 as a complement. Or we can use "liao" to replace the original complement in an informal occasion, like this. 吃得完 can be replaced by 吃得了。吃不完 can be replaced by 吃不了。Now you can see, 忘不了 means cannot forget. So this sentence means, I cannot forget that unhuman training toward kids. 我们来看一些例子。这么大一碗面，我吃不了。I cannot eat a, um, such a big. Bowl of noodles, of noodles. 好，警察来了，跑不了了。我外面有车，跑得了。想一想。好，第一句话的意思是 ，The police is coming. We cannot run away. 第二句话的意思是 ，I parked our car outside. We can run away. 好，这么多功课你做得了吗？做得了，做不了都要做啊。好，什么意思呢 ？A 问。There are so many homework assignments. Can you finish them? And B, 回答 Whether or not I can finish them, I would still have to do it. Do them. 好，现在读一下下面这句话，想一想它是什么意思。
。好，这简直是虐待儿童，哪里是杂技表演？哪里 ？Originally means where, but here it is used to form a re、um, rhetorical question like sentence. The reason why I call it a rhetorical question like sentence is because it does not necessarily end with a question mark. 哪里 practically equals to not in this sentence, so it is used to negate the statement after it, and it emphasizes the speaker's attitude or opinion. So, like in this sentence, the speaker definitely showed. Um, emotion, anger. So this sentence means, okay, 哪里 means 不 So this sentence means, 这简直是虐待儿童，不是杂技表演 This is virtually abusing children, not acrobatics. 我们来看一些例子。他哪里是爱国，不过就是喜欢看球赛。所以这句话的意思是，他不是爱国，不过只是喜欢看球赛。Means he's not being patriotic. He merely likes ball games. 你给我这么大一碗面。我哪里吃得完？ So， 这句话等于你给我这么大一碗面，我吃不完。Okay， we just learned this potential compliment. 吃不完。好，所以 it means you gave me. Such big bowl of noodles, I can't finish it. 好，天气预报说今天要下雨，结果哪里有雨 ？So here, 哪里 means 没 It's another negation word. 所以。这句话可以说成：天气预报说今天要下雨，结果没有雨。So weather report says it it is raining today, but turned out it is not raining. 好，看一下最后这句话，想一想它是什么意思。训练孩子成为有一技之长的人，绝不是虐待孩子。Training children to be people that have skills is definitely not abusing. So, 绝不 means definitely not. 好，绝。Is a shorter form for 绝对 but in a but you should know that in a positive sentence, 绝对 cannot be used with a shorter form. You have to say 绝对 But in a negative form, you can keep 绝对 as its full form. But you can also use a shorter form, 绝 And 不 can also be 没绝不绝没
我们来看一些例子。<咳>他中文说的那么好，绝对去过中国。So this is a positive statement. You have to keep 绝对 as its full form. So she speaks Chinese so well that she definitely has been in China before. 他绝对没去过中国，因为他关于中国的很多看法都是错的。也可以说他绝没去过中国。Either way, either either way works. 好，这个句子的意思是 ，He has definitely not been in China before because. Many of his opinions about China is incorrect. Are incorrect. McDonald's 太不健康了，我绝不吃。McDonald's is too unhealthy. I would definitely not eat it. 这一碗面我绝对吃不完。Now you should pay attention to this sentence. This in this sentence we used a、um, potential complement. So because of that, the negation word 不 is not immediately following 绝对 So you cannot. Change 绝对 to its shorter form. You have to keep it as the full form. 我绝对吃不完。好，读一下最后这个句子，想一想它是什么意思。今天的课就到这里，谢谢收看。